Hey guys, what is happening? I'm Eric Sir Six. Welcome to Eric Mealtime. And in today's episode, I'm going to catch my lunch. That's right, we're fishing down at the harbor in Ibaraki Prefecture, Japan. And we're going to catch some big ones. Some really big ones. You guys aren't going to believe this. These fish are huge, out of control. catch got about 50 of them in there oh yeah oh jackpot nice catch Boy, here we go gotta lay out the catch look at that huh there's the catch right there huh not bad for a couple hours work not bad at all Tsuri Kanamaru this might just be the coolest fishing shop in all of Japan oh yeah he does tours he does rentals Phenomenal. He's got girls all over the place. This is the shop. Yep. And let me introduce you to the master. There he is. He's right there. Yep. There he is again. See, always with the ladies. Yep. You guys want to meet this dude? Yep. Boy, what a cool shop. We'll show you inside. It's just, it's amazing the amount of gear in this place. Look at how. Look at how intricately it's all set up. Got stuff hanging from the ceiling. Incredible. This place has got some history. Serious history. Yep. There he is. He's coming out. He's coming out. Yep. Wow. Love this place. Look at that. Yep. This is incredible. Look at this. Another room over here. Wow, so much stuff. So many girls all over the place. Yeah, boy, hot chicks and fishing. Who would have thought, huh? Who would have thought? It's all the lures up there. Look at that, a fish even on the ceiling, huh? Look at that. That's a Suzuki fish right there. <laughs> Yeah, look at that. Here's all the gear, the poles, the rods. And... Oh, look at There he is. There he is, our guide and boss, the master. Looking good. Very nice. Yeah, there he is. Here's the catch. Wow. Yeah, boy, that was a lot of work. About two hours of fishing. Yeah. So, what kind of fish are you? Iwashi. Iwashi. Zenbu Iwashi. Iwashi and... I don't know if it's a fish. Ah, this is a sappa. Sappa, right? Yes. So, it's a fish. It's a fish. Okay, so they're all sardines, except for this one. And we're going to cook these things up. I think you just fry them. It's pretty easy. You can eat the bones. Yep. This is the biggest catch of the day right there. Yep. It's about as... Still smaller than my hand, but... Yep. Yeah, boy, that one was hard to pull in. He says, congratulations, that's the most any customer has ever caught. So, wow, thank you. Thank you so much. That was a great trip. I really enjoyed it. Very nice. The fish restaurant's just around the corner. Got the fish, gonna get it cooked up and feast. See how the fish are doing. Got them on ice. Oh boy, yeah, looking good. This is what's called a classic style izakaya in Japanese, right? It's a kind of cheap drinking bar, but their specialty is fish. So, fish. Today's catch. Sudemashita. 
ご苦労様でしたありがとうございますよろしくお願いします This is the best seat in the house, you know why? Because I got the alcohol right within hand's reach Oh yeah This is what's called bottle keep So there's names on each of these bottles from the customers Yeah So you can keep your bottle here Isn't that nice? This is going to be the tempura right here. Oh, yeah. Sardine tempura. Oh, master chef. We're going to do some Oshibori art. You know, hot towel artwork here. So you roll it up like that. This is the most important part right here. You don't want to put that on top. You want to have a little bit back here. You'll see in a minute why. Okay. You roll it up. Be easy. See that? Now you have their even. Okay. Just like this. And this is going to be the beak or the mouth. Okay, something like that. It's looking pretty good. And this is the wings. Yeah. And there you go. What do you have? Can you tell what it is? It's a giraffe. I mean, It's a penguin. Yeah, it's a penguin. And then you can take the wrapper from the Oshibori to tie it and make it permanent. So it's very nice. You just tie it in the back like this. All right. <clears throat> just twist it. Yeah, just like that. So it's that simple. All right. Get yourself a penguin. And it will stand up. Put it on the table. Just like that. Okay, cool. Little uh, simple arts and crafts while you're waiting for your fish to be cooked. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Quack, quack. Quack, quack. And then when you have to wipe your mouth, you just. Yeah. Yeah. It's still useful. The food has arrived. Oh, it smells so good. And I caught these just a couple hours ago. So. The sauce is shoyu, mirin, and osake. Yeah, Japanese sake is in here. And it's got a ginger in it. So, shoga flavored. Yeah. Wow, the preparation looks fantastic. Smells delicious. Here we go. You guys ready? You guys ready for this? Oh boy. Iwashi sardines. Bones and everything. Mmm. Wow. The bones just break apart. Nothing to them. Calcium. <laughs> oh, so good. Tell you what, though, it's all in the sauce. The sauce boss. That's Wantanabe san. He is the sauce boss. Oh, so good. You know, at first these tiny fish, I thought this was a joke. I thought, how are we going to eat these? This isn't going to happen, but it's the real deal. This is, oh my. So good. So good. And there's a whole bunch of other styles coming up. There's going to be tempura. There's going to be sashimi. And a couple other ways he's preparing this. So stay tuned. Oh, somebody's hungry. Go ahead. Help yourself. Oh boy, the sashimi has arrived. 
same fish. It's the same fish. So these are the bigger ones right here. We got some meat. Yep. A little show you. A little dark show you. Really dark. That's nice. Look at the presentation. Isn't this beautiful? Yeah. Put a little bit of this in. Spice it up a little bit. Yeah. Ginger. It's a ginger sauce. Chives. Oh, here goes. Get a good mix of it. Going in for the sashimi. Wow. More. Give me more. Oh, the flavor, the seasonings, perfect. The ginger really just makes it perfect. Oh, oh so good. Oh, so good. Mm. Yeah. Taikon radish. Mm. Never knew sardines could taste so good. I've only had them from a can before. This is amazing. How to make tempura. This guy's like a magician too. How do you get such tiny fish to turn into this? It's amazing. Well, you cut them, you cut them down the center, you open them up, and then you take out all the bones. But, yep, it's, it's hard to believe, but it's the same fish. You know, it's just been cut, opened up, the bones taken out, and now the beauty of Japan, tempura. Oh, tempura. Here we go. Need a little bit more show you. Sauce in it. Oh, with no show you with this. So the tempura is served with is served with cocaine. No, this, the tempura is served with this is salt right here. No show you, no sauce. Salt. Mm -hmm. So you just sprinkle a little bit on top like this. All right. Okay. That's all you got to do. Very simple. It's heavy. It's got some weight to it. Oh. Oh. The best dish so far. It's just, it keeps getting better and better. Oh, wow. Surprisingly meaty for how small it is. It's a lot of fish. Hmm. Meet the tail too. Oh. 
Perfection. Mm. He's put some vegetable garnish in here as well too. This is eggplant. This is shiso, mint leaf. We'll eat this first. Flaky, it just dissolved in my mouth immediately. Wow. I'm gonna just do this by hand. You're supposed to use chopsticks, but in the essence of saving time. So good. Ooh. Love the presentation. It's like a mountain. They're all stacked up together. He does this beautifully. You know, look at how it's stacked up like a bonfire. Gorgeous. All right, here's a big piece. It's a big one. One bite. <laughs> oh. Mm. oh, it's good. So good. Gonna finish it off with some hot sake. Oh, this meal, sardines. Wow, cooked three different ways. Well, one was sashimi, so it wasn't cooked. My compliments to the chef. To Mr. Wantanabe san. Oh, fantastic chef. Mm. Best ever. Yeah. I would have to give this a perfect six out of six rating. Yeah, definitely a six. So that means I'm giving away three of the snack packs. And if you're not familiar, there's a link up here and you can find out what's inside. The only thing you need to do is leave a comment down below and I will award three of them in the next video. So. Good luck to you guys. Thanks for watching. And eat fish. Definitely eat fish. Even the smallest ones can be delicious. So, see you next time.